Okay, so the bell pepper is just a really nice organic shape. So you could start out with a square if you needed to, but what I started with is just the top angle of the actual bell pepper to get the right angle. And it might, it's a bit sharp, so I'll adjust that as I go. But what I start with is the angle and then the side shapes with the right side, and then I look at the left side and back and forth. and and how far does this bump hang out compared to the bump lower. So I'm looking at the relationship of each line um, from side to side. So I look at the left side in comparison to the right side, the top of the pepper, where does it fall from the top of the pepper on the right side. And then, you know, as close as you can get, it never has to be perfect. Organic shapes are great to draw for that reason. As long as it reads as a bell pepper, you drew a bell pepper. Okay, so once I get this all correct, I erase my lines and I'm going to go through and I'm going to darken it up. One thing you want to avoid is sketchy, feathery lines. So even if you start that way, that's fine, but go back through and strengthen those lines up with one continuous line. It just shows confidence and it makes for a better read on your drawing. Now the stem starts dead center. And so what I looked at is where does the left side of the stem and the right side of the stem start and finish. And then the very tip of the stem, if I dropped that down, where would that um, where would that stop? And mine's a bit short. And I probably should have made the tip of the stem a little bit bigger with that oval. But again, it reads like a bell pepper, right? So there I've gone through and strengthened up my lines. And now I'm gonna add some shading. This is just quick value, and what I tried to do is more of like hatching um, style. And I also, on my previous line drawing, I used a um, a pencil, a mechanical pencil that was a 0.7 lead, and then when I'm shading I used a 0.9. And again that hatching is just one direction, it gives kind of this feathery texture. And I'm strengthening up any of the dark lines, and there's thicker and thinner areas to help with the value. Okay, and that's all it takes. Good luck!